high to the top of that right there, Angel's Landing. Thirteen people have died. This is freaking scary. We're Matt and Nat, a travel couple based out of Nashville, Tennessee. After having our world turned upside down in 2020, we decided to set out on our biggest adventure yet, to see all 50 states in a year. In last week's video, we were in Washington, D.C., where we explored the sites of the nation's capital, enjoyed a relaxing evening watching the sunset in the National Mall, and experienced the monuments by moonlight with Old Town Trolley Tours. This week, we're in the Beehive State. Welcome to Utah. Being home to five national parks, Utah is known for its vast landscapes and natural wonders. And today we're going to be exploring some of that natural beauty here at Zion National Park. We've got some awesome e-bikes rented from Ride Zion e-bikes that we're headed to pick up now and we can't wait to get this adventure started. So let's go. <laughs> shuttle system the way it's operating currently that's a really complicated system right now it's a ticketed system usually it's not usually it's first come first serve you yeah. get on and it's free right now it's like a month out you have to register for tickets and then the day before they release a handful of more tickets for so it's like a lottery visitors. it's kind of a lottery thing yeah. and we were talking to some people and they said it is pretty much a black market for the shuttle tickets because it is near impossible to get and that's why we decided to yep. do an e-bike so we're here at zion visitor center yep we just went to the bathroom which was very important yes. thank god they were open <laughs> <laughs> and we were about to get on the trail and we'll show you our bikes once we get on the trail we're, yes. we're just so excited to get started we are. So. it's already gorgeous and we oh. have any we literally we're just inside the entrance <laughs> and we're like wanting to take all the photos and video we're it's like, like no we gotta keep going yeah, let's keep going we got a big day ahead of us <laughs> to all 50 states this year so if you want to follow along on this journey please go and hit that subscribe button and give this video a big thumbs up we put out a new video every thursday so make sure you hit that notification bell so you don't miss out you can also follow along on instagram at adventures of matt and nat where we post story highlights of every trip look at our cool bikes <laughs> this is awesome About to start our hike, Angel's yep. Landing. I don't know if we're gonna make it all the way to the top because your girl's scared of heights. If you're gonna come do this hike, you come to Shuttle Stop 6 and straight across the road is the trailhead to Angel's Landing. Let's show you. This is amazing. I can't even, I'm just, <laughs> you just have to stand here and just take it in. We are headed to hike to the top of that right there, Angel's Landing. We might make it. We might only make it to Scout's Landing or Scout's Lookout, which is a little lookout before you get to the top. We'll see. We haven't even started yet, hardly. And we've got all these switchbacks to do. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> I've taken off some layers. I was freezing earlier. It went from cold to 
hot. Literally sweating right now. <laughs> but now we're in Refrigerator Valley, so yeah. now it's cold again. <laughs> yeah, so after you finish the first big set of switchbacks, you come into this valley and it immediately changes. But it's a nice welcome, <laughs> yeah. welcome thing after hiking up all those switchbacks. Yeah, my feet are cramping a little bit, but it's okay. <laughs> the views are worth it though, so. Oh, yeah, they're just nonstop views every turn. <laughs> up all the switchbacks which is the hardest part physically and we're at scout lookout now we've got 0.5 miles to angel's landing we just gotta see if That's we the have the mental <laughs> part though <laughs> because this is the tough mental part exactly especially if you're afraid of heights like me so we'll see. yeah we're gonna be hanging on the chains sorry mom going up the side of this mountain didn't tell you about yeah, this one <laughs> purposely <laughs> so you're welcome <laughs> rested here at Scout Landing for a little bit, taking in the views, and now I'm just staring over at Angel's Landing Trail, wondering if I'm gonna be able to do it. <laughs> there literally might be tears involved, but we'll see. Uh, so only 13 people have died, so. Hopefully it's not 14 today, or 15, because I'm <laughs> not going down alone. Feeling that? Well, we just started. I know. We're on okay. chains, though. So far, okay. <laughs> oh my gosh! We gonna go all the way up? This is very scary. <gasps> Look at that. That's a lot of freaking chains. Yeah. Is it worth it? Do you want to? I don't know how it turned out. I'm not gonna lie, this is the scariest by far, thousand percent scariest hike I've ever done. I am literally just so focused in on the chain and the rocks, I'm not even looking around. So, but it's up to you. Maybe we can get at least to this next point, it'll be a nice lookout. Yeah. We'll just go as far as we can go. Because that scares the crap out of me. But look at all those people doing it. That's what I'm like. Yeah. If they can do it, we can do it. That last bit was sketchy. With the sand? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, there was a sandy spot after the first or second set of chains. And somebody just wiped out. There's been a oh, couple yeah. of wipeouts. So I just want to take my time yeah. and let people pass. And if it takes us however long to get up there. This is. It's very scary. It is a serious hike. And it blows my mind that this many people do it. That's where we're going. Way up there. Yeah. And this is chains all the way up. Are you okay? Those landing twice. Those shuttle buses are so small. Yeah. I can't believe we're doing this. Oh, man. This is freaking scary. I thought Natalie was going to be the one scared. Me too. I thought I was going to cry. I'm. Uh, I've, there's been times where I'm really? and we're only at <laughs> we're not even at the top we still gotta go down and that's I think gonna be the worst part
made it. We're rewarding ourselves with Snickers. Snickers. That was, and still is, the scariest thing I've ever done. And we still gotta go down. I think down is gonna be worse. Yep. I'm truly frightened. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know if I've ever been scared for my life like this. Really? Mm -hmm. I was sorry, scared. Sorry, mom. Um, sorry, mom-in-law. Sorry. Yeah, Great is gonna be mad at you. My mom is gonna be mad at him for taking me up here. This was Matt's idea, she, by the way. I, it was my idea, but who's been the one that's been like, "Oh, we're so close. We yeah, can do this." Yeah, but who's the one that was the scaredest to do this? I couldn't sleep last night because oh, of this. She was scared to do it, and then we got out here, and I'm by far more scared to do yeah, it. Yeah, I don't understand why I'm not more scared, but. I can't think about it. Okay, we're, we're going to enjoy just, this view yes. at the top. We're going to eat a little bit, have a little Be snack. Because this view of Zion Canyon is... It is spectacular. Just amazing. This It looks straight down the canyon, back through the park. It's beautiful. It is. So that's why we did this. <laughs> and Matt said he'll never do it again. Nope. I won't. I won't regret doing it once I get to the bottom, but I won't do it again. <laughs> Check it off the bucket list. Look at this view. Pray for us. Yeah, we've hung out at the top probably an hour. Yeah. Um, just getting some food, getting some energy, and me mustering up the courage to make my way back down this mountain. I think we're literally <laughs> going to be on our butts the whole way, oh, but yeah. we'll see. It's only a half mile back down to Scout's Lookout, or Scout Lookout, as long as I can make it there, because from there, it's like, that's, a that's just gig. hiking. That's yeah. walking from there, so. All right, Whew, pray let's for do us. it. <laughs> halfway down the chains and honestly it hasn't been as bad so far fingers crossed um, you just got to zone in on one step at a time slide on your butt no shame in that but I think we're gonna do it I think we're gonna make it I recommend it. I don't I think I just mentally prepared because I'm really scared of heights I watch a lot of YouTube videos of this hike But it's still scary. So that's the biggest thing 
prepare. You gotta mentally prepare for this because, yeah, it's a strenuous hike, but this part is more mental than anything. Yeah. Just Absolutely. take it slow, have sure footing, good wear, good footwear, and yes. you'll be okay. Bring a lot of water too. Yep, those are all very valid and key points. And I'm not a hiker. <laughs> well, I guess I am. <laughs> you are. But yeah, I would say the biggest thing for me was it's not that strenuous physically. Yeah. Yeah, it's. You know, it, it's tough, but not crazy. It was a mental game for yeah, me. Absolutely. And a mental game I was close to losing a couple of times. I'm so proud of you though. You did great. <laughs> you did it. Oh, now we just got the two mile hike back to our bikes. Oh, piece of cake. <laughs> oh, I'm looking forward to that compared to that right there. It's all paved. We're good. <laughs> what it looks like when your legs are like jello after climbing to the top of Angel's Landing <laughs> and you're coming down what seems like a thousand switchbacks. You just take baby granddaddy steps. <laughs> <laughs> My legs feel like limp noodles. Hang on, hang on, let me, uh, let me show them what it looks like you walking. No, down. I'm embarrassed. <laughs> <laughs> I hope I make it down this mountain. We'll see. If you decide to come to Zion and do the Angels Landing hike, first off, you're crazy like we are, and you're I awesome. I like you already. Yeah. <laughs> it is two and a half miles one way from the parking lot, but I believe it's 1,500 feet of elevation gain, which is nothing to shake a stick at. It is, <laughs> it is pretty intense. It was so much fun. It's, even though I'll probably never do it again, it was worth it. officially all the way down and done with Angel's Landing and I couldn't be more excited to sit down. <laughs> Literally our legs feel like jello. Mm -hmm. Thank God we got e-bikes. <laughs> Best decision ever. Yep. Ride Zion e-bikes saved oh. our lives today. They're amazing. So. Possibly literally. <laughs> you should have seen us walking down that mountain. It was sad. <laughs> we made it though. We did. We did it. <laughs> My hands hurt so bad. This blister hurts. Ugh. Oh yeah. Matt's got two really bad ones. Mm -hmm. Now we're just eating a little snack and then we're gonna get on our bikes and explore the park before sunset. I will be relying on that throttle. <laughs> It. I still don't believe we did that. And that was only like, what, a couple hours ago? Up there. That's pretty impressive. <laughs> yep. I'm pretty awesome. Pretty, Same pretty again. adventurous. I'm pretty awesome. I did that. No, actually, I was a big scaredy cat the entire time. But, you know, I am known to be a little bit of a rebel. Oh, and off he goes. got back to the Zion Visitor Center and we're about to go return our e-bikes and we can't recommend enough. Oh my gosh. I mean, it was a spectacular experience. If you're yeah. coming to Zion, get you some e-bikes. Ride Zion e-bikes rentals 
They'll hook Amazing. you up. Kurt and his wife, Sarah, the owners are awesome. And we wouldn't have wanted to experience this park any other way. It made the experience so much better. If you were sitting inside of a shuttle, it's just a different experience. You're yeah. not out smelling the smell, seeing the deer like right next to you. Mm -hmm. Like it was just amazing. And getting to stop wherever you wanted, oh. take pictures. Yeah, it was just awesome. Yeah. yeah, I mean, we saw so many people walking and hiking all the yep. way through to the place that they wanted to go and hike yep. or see you, and we e-biked it you're talking about people putting in four miles before they even get to their trailhead just to get in the park and get up there because the shuttle system the shuttle system the way it's operating currently was actually a blessing in disguise huge for us blessing because we wouldn't have known anything about e-bikes mm -hmm. we would have just done the shuttle thing like everybody else and wouldn't have had a clue what we were missing out on 1000 <laughs> percent recommend this experience yep. i mean zion is just absolutely stunning it's yep. you, you gotta come yep so if you're gonna come soon or not so soon maybe in a year two years we're gonna put the link for ride zion e-bikes down check in the description them out. check it out they have multiple bike options and actually have some passenger options as well so if you and another person wanted to ride the same bike you could as long as you obviously didn't go over the max weight limit so my bike was one so i could have had a passenger if yep. i wanted to but it was really cool why didn't you let me rock on the back we could have been you, like dumb and dumber because you don't want to ride on the back <laughs> he never wants to ride anything that i'm driving true yeah. i'm a little scary yeah but it's called living on the edge <laughs> you know what i heard lately what if you're not living on the edge you're taking up too much space i agree with that we lived on the edge literally today so. my mom is gonna kill me i am so sorry mom i didn't tell her about this on purpose so all right well let's go but, return these e-bikes before yep. our rental let's time's go do up. that the sun is setting it's getting cool down here in the canyon but it is gorgeous oh my gosh love let's it go. Look, we got a tan. <laughs> we did. Ooh, thanks, Zion. My skin's as red as your rocks. <laughs> the desert gets really cold at night, just in FYI. <laughs> Especially when you're wearing leggings. Okay, anyways. So we just grabbed some quick takeout here in Springdale, and we're going to close out our night here. And unfortunately, that ends our time here in Zion and Springdale. We hope you've enjoyed watching this video as much as we enjoyed making it. We love Utah. It is awesome. <laughs> so if you like this video, please make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Also, make sure you subscribe. We put out a new video every Thursday. So make sure you guys come back next week when we're in state. Number 13. <laughs> we'll see you guys then. <laughs> How cool do we look? This place is amazing. And we haven't even I know. Haven't even started. <laughs> what? And it's bigger in real life. <laughs> I can't believe I'm doing this and I'm not crying. Just want to apologize in advance, Mom. Love you so much. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You can't nod your head. I know. This can funny. This camera's on the back of Natalie's head, so yeah. come on. <laughs> head down, head down. Right there. Hold it right there.